more than welcome to ask as many as you like and you can just ask your teacher to send them through to us and we'll try and answer as best we can for you. So I was saying that this is a white-backed vulture and these white-backed vultures, the most common vulture that we see in this area, they tend to be quite um, prolific and so often you'll find in the early morning like it is now where it's still quite cold and there's a little bit of dew on the grass that the vultures are still sitting on these dead trees and the reason why is because their wings get a little bit of dew on them they get a bit damp and so they need to sit in these open trees just to dry out before they start to fly also they're waiting for thermals to start coming so when the sun goes up it starts to heat the land and the land then gives off heat and as the heat is going up it tends to move in a circular fashion up into the sky and so these vultures because they're so heavy and if they had to flap their wings all the time like other birds they're going to use so much energy that they're not going to be able to stay up there so they wait until those rings of hot air are rising off the land and then they come and they get onto those and then they'll start soaring in a circular motion and they start going up into the sky to look for food and they'll be looking for any dead animals that they can then go and scavenge off man hey you're wondering if i've ever caught the death of an animal well i have indeed i have seen a few animals unfortunately being killed um, due to varying predators so we have lots of things that kill out here we've got lions and leopards and wild dogs and cheetah and hyenas so lots of the big carnivores but then there's also lots of small carnivores so there's the birds like this that come down and grab things from time to time and so we do see quite a few animals unfortunately dying it's quite something to watch particularly when you get the cats hunting big large animals so lions hunting buffalo it's a battle of power between the two of them and it's something that can go on for sometimes up to three four hours so it's quite something but it's not as entertaining as you would think